So y'all thought we were finished? <laughs> no. What's up, Courtney crew? And welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello, my name is Courtney B. And thank you so much for clicking on this video and watching. And if you are an oldie but a goodie subscriber, hey girl, welcome back. So recently, I did a little shopping. And when I say a little shopping, I mean a lot of shopping like I went shopping this past Tuesday when I was off and I went shopping this past Saturday when I was off like I have a serious shopping problem like serious shopping problem like my debit card is not happy with me but I'm happy so really that's all that matters like if you don't believe me look at all the stuff I got I went to Charlotte Russe Ulta I went to the store in the mall called Dazzle Up, and the biggest bag of all, <sighs> I went to the Bath and Body Works in my annual sale. So, if y'all would like to see what all I bought, go ahead and keep on watching. So, I guess we'll start with Ulta first. Well, I went to Ulta mainly just to get the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist, but they didn't have it, so I was like, why not buy something else, Courtney? And so I did. And plus, I had that little promo for three times the points when you purchase something. So I had to get a couple things there. So the first thing that I got is the I Heart Revolution Fixing Spray. And it's infused with vanilla and coconut. And this is what it looks like right here. I've never tried anything from this brand before. I'm pretty sure this is a sister brand to the Makeup Revolution line. And all this stuff is so cute. And This smells so good. It smells just like vanilla. Like, you can't really smell the coconut, but the vanilla in here smells amazing. So, I can't wait to use that. So, the next thing I got is also from Makeup Revolution. And I got the Makeup Revolution Matte Lipstick in the shade Hustle. And it's like this briny pinky color. Like, that's the favorite kind of lipsticks that I like. This is it swatched right there. Like, if I pair this with a dark brown lip liner, this will look so good. Okay, so the last thing that I purchased from Ulta is the Morphe 3502 palette. And I've been wanting this palette for like forever. Like it was on the Ulta website like a couple months ago and then they took it off and then they recently bought it back. And like y'all, they redid the packaging. Like the packaging looks so much better. Like I have a 350 palette, but this is 3502. And like the packaging is so much better. Like And it comes with that slip with the shade names, and these are the shades right here. Like this, this right here is so pretty. Like, I can't wait to start playing with this. This is so pretty, y'all. Like, look at it. And like the packaging is so much better than what it was. Like, it looks like it should be more than $24. Like, this palette looks so good. And it feels heavy, like. Morphe is just killing it with their packaging and their eyeshadows. Okay, so that's all I got from Ulta. So let's move on into Bath and Body Works now. So I got the most stuff from Bath and Body Works. Okay, so all this was a purchase at one time. I purchased four, well, six of the items. I'm sorry, I purchased six of the items before the sale, and then I purchased the rest after the sale, if that makes any sense. So I have a, quite a few think, body care items. So I guess we'll start with the things that I purchased before the sale started. And when I go in Bath and Body Works, I know some people can buy like a lotion and a spray but not get the shower gel or the other way around. I have to get all three. Like I like sets. And if I don't have the perfume, if I don't have the body mist, the shower gel and the lotion, I, I, don't, I don't want it. I don't want it. But that's besides the point. The first set that I got is the Wild Strawberry Fragrance Mist. And I also got the Wild Strawberry 24, Mo 24 Hour Moisture Ultra Shea Butter Body Cream. And the packaging on this is so cute. And then I also got the Wild Strawberry Shea and Vitamin E Shower Gel. And this, y'all, smells so good. It smells just like strawberries. Strawberries and like, I don't know what other fruit that it smells like, but it smells like strawberries and something else, but 
I love this. This is one of my favorite ones that I purchased so far. And the next set that I got is the Lavender and Cotton Flower Lotion. And I have used this one already. And then I also got the Matching Shower Gel and the Mist. These these honestly just smell like lavender and fresh linen to me. Like, I don't smell the floral in this, but it just smells like uh, fresh linen and lavender. That's it. I don't like overly floral scents, if that makes sense. Like, I do not like anything floral like that. Like, it just makes my head hurt. I do not like it at all. The next couple items are what I purchased from the actual sale. I got the scent Beach Nights Summer Marshmallow. And then I got the matching Ultra 24 Hour Ultra Shea Butter Body Cream. And look at this packaging, y'all. Like, maybe I should have started holding it back like that. I'm, I'm an idiot. I'm sorry. Like, this packaging is everything. And then I got the Mist. But this, normally I don't like marshmallow, but this smells so good like it smells like coconut and marshmallow mixed together oh my god uh, I cannot wait to use this I'm gonna use this when I go on vacation next month so I'm super excited to use this like that's gonna be amazing to get. and then the last three things that I got are also a set surprise but I got the sunset guava sunset guava colada and this is the shea butter and aloe shower gel and then I got the matching body lotion and you guessed it the mist and this one this one doesn't this just smells like coconut I just smell the colada in this like this doesn't have like any other scent other than like the colada smell but I really like this one. Like I smelled so many things in Bath and Body Works that day. Like my head started hurting. But that is it from Bath and Body Works, y'all. So I guess we'll move into the clothing portion of this haul. Next. So the next clothing store I went to, I went to the Columbia and Mall here in South Carolina. And I don't think every mall has this store, but the mall I went to did, and it's called Dazzle Up, and it's just in this regular smuggler white bag. But. <clears throat> The main reason, the only reason I went to the mall was to get these pair of shoes. But I ended up coming out with a whole bunch of other mess that I didn't need. But I did purchase the shoes that I want. And I got these little sandals. Aren't they cute? They're like glitter, gold glitter. I love sandals like this. Like any kind of sandal made like this, I will buy because I just like the the style of these like these are so pretty and I can't wait to style these with an outfit like my boyfriend calls them Jesus sandals like he always he either calls them what is it he calls them my pastries or my Jesus sandals like he makes fun of every pair of sandals that I get like this but I don't care I'm gonna be cute anyway and then the best part about this store is that they have like long sleeve shirts and long short sleeve shirts for cheap. Like they're usually five dollars, but when I went, they were two ninety nine. So I caught me a real cute one, and I just got this long sleeve blue shirt, and it just says Simply Southern down the sleeve. Oh, the shoes that I got are also Simply Southern. If y'all were wondering. And it has this cute little turtle on the back. Like, look at him. He looks like the polo bear. Like, you know how polo, like Ralph Lauren has like that bear? This is the turtle to Simply Southern. Like, it is so cute. And they do the Save the Turtles thing, and I love turtles. What do you think? I like turtles. All right, you're great zombie. But this shirt is so cute and it was only $2.99. So I'm going to go back and get me some more. I'm sorry, y'all, if the lighting changed, if it suddenly got darker. I'm filming in front of a window and with my ring light. And it looks like it's about to storm really bad. So if the lighting changed, I am so, so sorry. Just 
bear with me with this crazy South Carolina weather that we have. Like, it's ridiculous. It's more bipolar than I am. What? What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? And closing this haul, we will be going into my Charlotte Roof purchase. And I know what you're thinking, Courtney. Some of the Char most of Charlotte Roosters are closed. I thought that too. I thought they were going out of business forever, but apparently 28 stores are opening back up now. So when I seen that Charlotte Roos was open, I seen people, okay. I'm rambling, I'm sorry. I was in Forever 21 and I seen people with Charlotte Roos bags. I'm like, I know Charlotte Roos is closed. What, what, what's going on here? I'm not getting the tea. Like, y'all weren't gonna tell me the store open back up. So when we walked, went, went, I went with my cousin. And when me and my cousin walked in, like everything was 50% off. Like the entire store was 50% off. Say what now? Yes, ma'am. So I did buy a couple of things. So the first shirt that I got is this floral shirt right here. And it's like the shirt that I got on now. It's like, it hangs on your shoulders and it's like made out of this stretchy material. I wonder if y'all can see. It's like ribbed stretchy material. And it's supposed to be cropped and this is super cute like this gives me vacation vibes like this shirt is so pretty and like with a cute pair of jean shorts or a cute pair of like jeans this looks so cute. and then i also got another rib top a rib crop top the same style but i got it in yellow because i love yellow on my skin tone like yellow looks so good so i got that in yellow and it's just made out of the same stretchy material as the other one and sorry the um sh the simply southern shirt the long sleeve shirt i got that in a small and the sandals also got in a seven and then this shirt i got this in a medium and then this one i got in a small because it was the only one that they had left and i would have got this in a medium because my clothes shrink in the wash and i hate that so i had to get that in a small unfortunately and then the next shirt that I got is this one right here. It's another crop top, but it's like a Bantu situation going on. And I got this in a size. Hmm. For some reason, I got this in a large. What? Why did I pick this up in a large? I'm an idiot, right? Oh. But besides the point, I got this cute little blush pink Bantu top, crop top situation. And it's like really cropped and I wouldn't wear this unless I had like high-waisted shorts or high-waisted jeans to go with it. But I bought this to pair with these cute paper bag shorts. And I got these in a small, and they're just like tan, white, and pink. And they're just so cute. Like, I've never owned paper bag shorts or paper bag pants before. And so I was like, let me go try these on. And they were so cute. So I'm gonna pair this with this top. I know they're like different color pink, but far away you can't tell. See? So they look kind of the same, but you'll see in a try on, but. These are super cute and I can't wait to wear these to like brunch or like something like that. So y'all thought we were finished? <laughs> no. So I had forgot that I also purchased more Bath & Body Works stuff, but this is for my boyfriend. The bag is kind of beat up, but I thought I should haul it in this haul anyway because I bought this for him. And it's only three items and they're all shower gel because he only likes to shower gel for some reason. He doesn't like lotion but the first body wash that i got is the new or men's collection two-in-one hair and body wash for him can you see it there it is and this one i don't know this one just smells i can't describe which what the men's one smell like so do not ask me because I don't know, but this is a good smell. I like this one. And then I got the Oceans 2-in-1. 
And this is my favorite one out of all the ones I bought. Out of all the ones he got, this is my favorite one. And I got this one in a car clip that from Bath and Body Works that you put in your car. I got this in a car clip because it smells so good. And then the last thing I got him is the Bourbons one. This is it right here. And Bath and Body Works doesn't have a big men section for some odd reason. They need to come out with new scents for men, but. These are the three things that I got him. So that is it for my shopping haul. I hope y'all all enjoyed this video. If you did and you like hauls and want to see more, give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, go ahead and click that subscribe button down at the bottom because it's free and why not? I mean, it's a fun time over here. I do, if I do say so myself, duh. But it's free and I'm pretty sure you may or may not come back for another video. But do subscribe. I'll thank you a million. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.